So what we have here are black skimmers. Black skimmers are a, a state threatened species in Florida. So we only have about 3,600 left in the state. And here are 700 adults. So this is actually the second largest breeding colony in the state of Florida. And this is 20% of their entire population. I'm keeping an eye out for birds and especially looking at the feathered chicks and the downy chicks to see if any of them are out on a dangerous part of the beach. Mm -hmm. Sometimes they are and then we have to stay aware of them. More people get on the beach, I will just stand by the colony and talk to people and tell them about our birds. Right now we have about 250 chicks on the ground and the chicks are fairly close to fledging. We have about 230 that can fly, um, but then still a few that are tiny and fluffy and walking around on the ground. So this year, when they started laying eggs, we sort of started having a problem with crows. So crows are notorious for taking eggs, and crows have become a problem in the past few decades because with human development, you have more crows coming in because they're generalists, so they can take advantage of a situation where you have roads and buildings. So there have been more crows, and they were starting to take eggs at the beginning of the season. But then after that, once the eggs started hatching, then you had all these tiny, downy chicks on the ground, and the gulls started coming in. And gulls, just like crows, are a human subsidized species. So there are more of them here because we're here. And we probably saw them take about a dozen chicks, although most of the time we were not actually on the beach. So I assume it was several times that many. Um, so that was probably the biggest problem for them in terms of um, survival this year. But now that most of the chicks are, are pretty much fully grown, Really the main issues are just getting people to take it slow when, we're, when they're walking through the bird area and just be mindful of where they're stepping because the chicks still can't move quite quickly enough. They'll say, hey, we have these baby birds on the ground, would you mind just taking it slow and walking around this way and they're totally okay with that. But all we can do is educate them and let them know that their behavior does affect the birds.